טוב, השבת הזו יש לנו רגע מאוד מיוחד. We have got a really important moment this Shabbat. Uh, הדובר שלנו איש מאוד מיוחד, איש אלוהים. Our speaker is such a special man, a man of God. Uh, לא רק שהוא אח במשיח, אלא גם חבר. Not just that he's a brother in Messiah, but he's also a very good friend. הוא משרת uh, כרואה קהילה בקהילת... Uh, האמת באהבה. And he serves as a pastor in קהילת האמת והאהבה. כאן בעיר חיפה. Here in Haifa. והוא נמצא עם אשתו סלאם והילדים. And he's here with his beautiful wife סלאם and their beautiful children. אז כשאני אומר הוא אח. And when I say that he's a brother. לא מאותה אימא, אבל מאותו אבא. Not from the same mother, but from the same father. אז אני רוצה להזמין את אחינו בני. בואו בני. שלום שלום. שלום. שבת שלום. שבת שלום. Uh, אני מאוד מאוד שמח להיות כאן היום. I'm really really glad to be here today. מאוד. Very much so. Uh, זה טוב להיות ביחד. It's good to be together. אבל אני מאוד שמח מהרבה סיבות. But I'm very glad for many reasons. אבל אני רוצה שנזכור לעצמנו למה אנחנו צריכים להיות שמחים כשאנחנו ביחד? But I want for us to remind ourselves why should be, we be glad that we're together. כי האלוהים הנאמן שאנחנו מאמינים בו, because the faithful God that we believe in, האדון הטוב, the good Lord, נתן לנו הבטחה. has given us a promise. ברגע שאנחנו מתאספים בשמו, שתיים ושלוש. In the moment that we gather together, in his name is two or three. והוא אמר שהוא בתוכנו, איתנו. He said that he is here in our midst. הוא עמנואל. He is עמנואל, God with us. לא סתם בשביל להיות איתנו. And it's not just to be with us. אלא גם הוא אמר שהוא ציווה. But he has also said that he has commanded. ברגע שאנחנו ביחד. At the moment that we are together. ברכה. A blessing, חיים, life, לעולם. forever. So let's receive his blessing today together. Because he is faithful and what he has said, he will do it. So I am so glad to be here with you today. Because we believe. We believe in his word. We believe in Yeshua. We believe in God. That's the reason that we're here together. And if, that, if we believe in him, we believe in what he said. And therefore he is with us. And he has commanded a blessing and everlasting life. And so I'm very glad to be here. I'm very glad to be here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It is good to be together. There's nothing better than that. Right? לכן אנחנו צריכים לזכור מדי פעם על ההבטחה של אלוהים. The promise of God. זה לא סתם שגרה אנחנו עושים. It's not just some routine that we're doing. אלא באמת הוא נאמן. But he is truly faithful. הוא נאמן אמיתי. He is truly faithful. כמה טוב כמו ששרנו. How good he is, like we sing. באמת אני מאוד אוהב את ישוע. And I truly love Yeshua. אני מאוד מאוהב בו. I'm really in love with him. כי אני ראיתי בחיים שלי שהוא נאמן. Because I've seen in my life that he is faithful. למה שהוא אומר הוא נאמן. And whatever he says, he is faithful to it. Whatever he says, he is faithful Amen. to it. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So therefore, we need to be glad. glad. I want to remind you today and encourage you today to remember what God has promised us. And to remember, remember, remember. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So, so let's pray briefly and then I'll talk about what God put on our heart. Our Father and our King, we thank you. Truly we are glad to be together with you here. It is great to be together. Because we know that you have commanded a blessing and life. True life. Life with you, Father. 
אמיתיים וטובים. ואנחנו שמחים. אבינו שבשמיים, אנחנו מאמינים שאתה איתנו כאן. אתה איתנו ברוח. בשביל לעודד אותנו, בשביל לדבר אלינו, בשביל, וואו, הללויה, להראות לנו ולתת לנו כיוון. לכן אנחנו מאוד שמחים. אבינו שבשמיים, אני מבקש היום שבאמת תדבר אלינו בדברך, בדברך האמיתיים. אני מבקש אדון, ולא הבשר, ולא הדם, מחשבות של בשר ודם שישתקו, רק אתה תדבר אלינו. But you would speak ברוח, to us by the Spirit. ברוח, by the Spirit. ממך רק אבינו שבשמיים. That we would hear from you, Father אנחנו heaven. יודעים שאנחנו רוצים הרבה דברים. Lord, we know that we want many things. אני גם יש לי הרבה רצון. I have many desires. אבא, אבל אני מבקש היום שרק יהיה את מה שאתה רוצה. But Father, I ask that only what you want would be accomplished today. אני יודע שאתה יודע מה אנחנו צריכים. Because you know what we need. ומה טוב לנו. And what is good, how good Abba, it is for us. לכן אבא, אנחנו מפקידים את הזמן הזה. So we dedicate this time. את האסיפה. This, this service. את הכל הבא. Everything, Father. בשמך הקדוש. In your holy name. בשם ישוע המשיח. In the name of Yeshua the Messiah. אמן. אמן. הללויה. אמן. אלוהים ידבר אלינו. God will speak to us. כשאחי אמר לי, תבוא, תדבר, uh, אתם יודעים, כי אנחנו צריך להתפלל ולבוא לאלוהים, אבא. When my brother asked me to, to speak, you know, we have to come and really ask the Lord, Father, what, what do you want, us, want me to speak about? You know, it's not something where you just come and you speak. But you say, Father, if you've opened up this door, then what do you want to say to these people today? I asked, Lord, please give me a word. And I asked, Lord, please give me a word. ואדון כיוון אותי למעשה השליחים, פרק ד'. אז אני רוצה, אנחנו נדבר על זה. So we'll speak about that. אני אקרא את הפסוקים מ-1 עד 19, ככה. So I'll read from okay. verse 1 through 19. כאשר דיברו אל העם, באו אליהם הכוהנים. ונגיד בית המקדש והצדוקים, כועסים היו על שלימדו את העם ובישרו בישוע את התחייה מן המתים. הם תפסו אותם, וכיוון שהיה כבר ערב, כלאו אותם עד למחרת, אולם רבים מהשומעים את הדבר האמינו, ומספרם היה כחמישת אלפים. למחרת נאספו שריהם, זקניהם, סופריהם, בירושלים, גם חנן הכהן הגדול וכיפה, יוחנן ואלכסנדרה, ובני משפחות הכהנים הגדולים. הם העמידו אותם בתווך ושאלו, באיזה כוח או באיזה שם עשיתם את זאת? עד כאן, אחר כך אני אמשיך. כמו שאנחנו... Okay, okay, can I okay. again? Uh, now, as they spoke to the people, the priests, the captain of the temple, and the Sadducees came upon them, being greatly disturbed that they taught the people and preached in Yeshua the resurrection from the dead. And they laid hands on them and put them in custody until the next day, for it was already evening. However, many of those who heard the word believed, and the number of men came to be about 5,000. And it came to pass on the next day that their rulers, elders, and scribes, as well as Anas, the high priest, Caiaphas, Yohanan, Alexander, and as many as were of the family of the high priest, were gathered together at Jerusalem. And when they had set them in the midst, they asked, by what power or by what name have you done this? By what power or by what name have you done this? אבל כשהתלמידים, כיפה ויוחנן, באו מול האנשים שעמדו אותם, שאלו אותם, באיזה כוח ובאיזה שם עשיתם את זה? So we know what happened before this, and, and they brought John and, and Peter before the, the, the leaders, and they asked them, by what power or by what name have you done this? כוח ושם. The power and the name. שם וכוח. Name and power. קרה משהו. Something happened. קרה משהו שהם לא עשו את זה לפני. Something happened that they hadn't seen before. כי הם גם משרתים, הם מכירים את העם, אבל קרה משהו בירושלים. Because they were also serving the people, in, but they, something happened in Jerusalem. ואנשים שמעו, ואנשים ראו באים ושומעים. But some people came and, and heard. והם לא יודעים מה עשיתם. 
And they, they didn't know what, what did you do? Be'ezza kuach wa be'ezza shem. By what power and by what name? Hallelujah. Be'ezza kuach wa be'ezza shem. By what power and by what name? Mahe ma'asu. What did they do? Anakhnu yakholim likro perek gimel mi'akhora. We can read in chapter 3 right before this. Pasuk 6. Verse 6. Ele shakifa amar kesev vazav en li. אבל את מה שיש לי, את זה אתן לך. בשם ישוע המשיח מנצרת, התהלך. Then Peter said, silver and gold I do not have, but what I do have I give you. In the name of Yeshua the Messiah of Nazareth, wise up and walk. אני פשוט מקצר, כי אתם מכירים את הסיפור, אבל כיפה ויוחנן באו לתפילה. I'm going to say it briefly because you know the story, but Peter and John went to pray. היו בדרכם לבית מקדש. They were on their way to the temple. יש מישהו שתמיד ככה מבקש נדבה מאנשים? כולם מכירים אותו? Everybody knows him. כל יום יושב שם? Every day he's sitting there. אנשים נותנים לו? People give him money. נותנים לו לאותו יום. Give him something for that day. אבל את המצב שלו לא שינה. But his situation didn't change. אתם יודעים, כל מה שאנחנו נקבל מבני אדם הוא לא ישנה. You know, the things that we will receive from people, there won't be a real change. But what comes from heaven? What's from God? He completely changes our lives. We are totally different. Like of Paul, when the Spirit of God came upon him, he changed. ויוחנן באים לבית מקדש, לתפילה, רגיל. So uh, Peter and John were coming to the temple like regular. אותו בן אדם גם רגיל, הוא מבקש מאנשים, כי ראה אנשים, הוא רוצה כסף. And this person, like usual, was begging because he wanted money. אבל כיפה אמר, But Peter said, כסף וזהב אין לי. I, I don't have silver and gold. כסף וזהב אין לי. Silver and gold I do not have. אבל אני רוצה לתת לך את מה שיש לי. But I want to Hallelujah. give you what I do have. אמן. את מה שיש לי אני רוצה לתת לך. What I do have I want to give to you. מה יש לו? What does he have? מה היה לו? What did he have? אמר לו בשם ישוע המשיח. He said in the name of Yeshua the Messiah. Rise up and walk. תקום. Get up. Hallelujah. לכן זה מה שקרה. And therefore, that's what happened. Kam, the person got up, להתהלך, started walking. You know what he did the first thing? He went with them to Hallelujah. the temple. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Into the house of God. I'll tell you why. Aze, this person, shalo, because of his disabilities, he was not kosher. He couldn't enter into the temple. Lachem. Think about it. כולם נכנסים ויוצאים. Everybody going in and out. He also wants to go in. He wants like everybody. אבל הוא לא יכול. למה? Why? יש לו מגבלות. He has a disability. He isn't kosher. הוא פחות מבני אדם. He's like a lesser human. אבל היום הזה, But on this day, השתנה משהו. Everything changes. בא משמיים. Something from heaven. ישוע בא, הללויה. ישוע קיים. אני מאמין שכל אחד פה, I believe that everyone here, on one day, Yeshua came into our lives, and He changed us, and He changed us, and He did a miracle in our lives. I, I am a witness of this. אני לא סתם עומד פה. I'm not just standing here. באמת ישוע עשה נס בחיים שלי. Yeshua did a miracle in my life. נס עשה. He did a miracle. הוא הרים אותי למטה. מלמטה. He, he brought me up out of from low. מהבור. From, from the pit. מהבור. From the pit. אני. I. שנולדתי. When I was born. בגיל חצי שנה. At the age of half a year. אמא שלי. My mother. זרקה אותי. Threw me away. אבל אני פה היום. But I'm here today. Hallelujah. 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 Mama Bani Saper Lachem Ala Edu Tachayim Shali. Next time I'll tell you about my testimony. And that's why I love Yeshua so much. I'm so much in love with him. Yeshua does signs and wonders in our lives. And so therefore this man, he was changed. They saw him in the temple, worshiping Yeshua, singing, he was jumping, people are looking around, is that the same person? Is that the same person we saw him outside before? He was asking for money. Now he's with us, and he's jumping, he's worshiping, what, he's equal to us? Something happened, something happened. Therefore, 
באיזה כוח ובאיזה שם עשיתם את זה? In what power and by what name did you do this? באיזה כוח ובאיזה שם עשיתם את זה? By what power and by what name did you do this? זה לא נתפס. It's just unbelievable. זה לא נתפס. It's unbelievable. זה השתנה משהו. Something changed. זה לא רגיל. It's, it's, it's not normal. לכן, כיפה ויוחנן Therefore, Peter and John עמדו למשפט. Said this sentence. לחקירה. They, they, they were there for being Alma. investigated. Alma. For what? Al for a good deed. Al for a good deed. Have you ever heard? There was somebody who was invited into the police to investigate because he did a good deed. No, it doesn't happen. <laughs> no, there wasn't anything like that. But when Yeshua was not alive, when we believe in him, It's the other way around from what we would think. So therefore today, I want for us to remember this name. That name. Because in that name, there's so much power. There's so much wisdom. There's so much love. There's so much authority. There's so much humility. So much peace. So much truth. So much light. Therefore, we together, especially in, in our land, especially in this nation, in the midst of our people, that name, every day, all the time, every day, all the time, we need to declare the name of Yeshua. You know what they say. Right? Right? It's a curse. We need to break off the curse from our people. In the name of Yeshua, we will break it off. I don't know if I'm wrong, you can tell me. I don't think that there's another nation where they, they call the name of Yeshua a curse word. They call him Yeshua. I think that all of you know what that means. It's the enemy who has done that. It's the strategy of the enemy. That the name of Yeshua that they wouldn't say his whole name, his full name. That when we say in the name of Yeshua things can happen. Things can be transformed. Yeshua. 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 Hallelujah. 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 So, you know, when they ask us, who are you? We're Messianic Jews. We believe. Okay, up until this point it's okay. Up until that point it's okay. At the moment we say, we believe in Yeshua the Messiah. Oh. <laughs> Things start happening. <laughs> People don't want to hear that name. They, they don't want to hear that name. So therefore I want to encourage you, brothers and sisters. We believe in Yeshua the Messiah. Declare his, name. Declare his name in this land amongst our people because this name has power in it. This name can change things. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Yeshua said, whatever you ask for in my name, I will do it. Everything that you ask in my name, I will do it. He said, what, I will do it. If you ask for anything in my name, I will do it. I believe in Yeshua. He is a speaker of truth. He is a speaker of truth. Is there anybody here who believes in Yeshua? He is a speaker of truth. He is a speaker of truth. Therefore, we need to ask in his name. We need to pray in his name. To worship in his name. To speak in his name. The enemy doesn't want it. The enemy doesn't want it. The enemy doesn't want it. Hallelujah. 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 So after they ask him, by what name did you do this? Verse 8 says this. Then Peter, filled with the Holy Spirit, said to them, 
Rulers of the people and elders of Israel, if we this day are judged for a good deed done to a helpless man, they say, you're investigating us because we've done a good deed for this sick person? You remember when Yeshua came to the temple? He saw the sick and he healed the sick. And the people said, how are you doing this? It's Sabbath. It's Sabbath. And what offended them was that the religion, but what was important to Yeshua, it was people. He loves people. He has come for all of us. So Peter says, for a good deed you're investigating us? By what means he has been made well? So after they spoke with them some in verse 18, so they called them and commanded them not to speak at all or to teach in the name of Yeshua. After they investigated them, they didn't know what to do with them. They couldn't hide what they had done because the people saw it. The, the people were coming they wanted to hear and to believe. So what the enemy did, they said to them, not to speak and not to teach anything in the name of Yeshua. That's what the enemy tries to do today. That we wouldn't speak in the name of Yeshua. That we wouldn't teach in the name of Yeshua. That we wouldn't speak about of our faith in the Yeshua name of Yeshua. Yeshua is scary. <laughs> you know, there are believers sometimes who don't want to. I'm, I'm a Messianic believer. Yeshua, ah. But Yeshua. Look at what the enemy did. That's what they commanded. Not to teach. And not to speak. In that name. In that name. In that name. In, that name. What name? In the name of Yeshua. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of Yeshua. And that's what the enemy does today. You know, and, and that's what I pray when I was praying. That's what God put in my, in my heart. This is the sign. We need to pray. We need to declare. In, in our hearts, in, in the midst of our people, the name of Yeshua. Hallelujah. Because that name is full of power. He is true. He is true. He is love. He is good. He changes things. Our people need this name. Our people need the name of Yeshua the Messiah. Our people need to repent. Not to say Yeshu, but to say Yeshua the Messiah. That's our prayer. That's what they said to them. Don't say, do whatever you want. Do whatever you want. Do whatever you want. Aval. <laughs> But, but don't teach in that name. But don't speak in that name. Do something else. That's what the enemy wants. That we wouldn't speak in that name. Why? 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 In verse 17, it says, But so that it spreads no further among the people, let us severely threaten them that from now on they speak to no man in this name. You understand what the enemy wants? Why he doesn't want for us to speak in that name? 
I'll read it again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But so that it spreads no further among the people. Me. Who? Yeshua. 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 So that the people Et wouldn't Yeshua. hear. Not about Peter and Et about Yeshua. John. That they wouldn't hear about Yeshua. That's the one that makes a difference. He's the one who saves. He is the one who is our life. He is the one who is our life. Therefore, the enemy says, Don't say but so that it spreads no further among the people, let us severely threaten them that from now on they speak to no man in this name. That was a law that went forth. It was a command. With threats. Don't speak in that name to anyone. You understand, right, what the enemy wants? As soon as people hear that name, their lives can change. People repent. They start to worship the God of Israel in spirit and in truth. They don't look at people. They don't look at the, at the elders. The authority is from above. People are all see the light from above in, in spirit and truth. And these people, these leaders said at the moment that they would know Yeshua, they will know the truth, they will worship Yeshua. They will worship the God of Israel. And they wouldn't worship them. <laughs> Not them. So they would lose a lot. The enemy, that's what he wants. Until today. Till today. He also wasn't, doesn't want for us to declare the name of Yeshua in Israel. Sometimes, sometimes uh, at my work, that they ask, what do you believe in? There's, there's no problem. They listen. But when I say that I, I believe in Yeshua, oh, you're a Christian. No, 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 Yeshua. Then, then they just close the door. Then the conversation ends. Because the enemy doesn't want for these people to know the truth. Because when we know the truth, we will be set free. That's what Yeshua said, that if you know the truth, you will be set free. Be set free from religion, from the culture, from the mindset. And we receive Yeshua. And what he brings with him. What he has done. So that's why they said, don't, don't speak anymore in his name. Because in that name there's much power. There is much truth. He's the one who changes lives. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So therefore I want to encourage you today. To declare his name. To pray in his name. And speak in his name. Speak with people. Hallelujah. Ask for wisdom. But speak. His name. We need to we need to use that name in our congregation, in our prayers, in our worship. You know, a congregation can really prosper financially. It can have a lot of people. It can have a great building. But if you don't have the name of Yeshua, if he isn't the center, if we don't call upon his name, there's no power. There's no power. There's no power. Therefore, always, 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 we need to remember to believe in that name and to rejoice in that name because there is power in that Hallelujah. name. Hallelujah.
כתוב אל פיליפים, פסוק שתיים, פרק שתיים, אתם יודעים, אני אקרא את זה, אלוהים נתן לו את השם הנעלה על כל שם, למען תקרא בשם ישועה כל ברך, בשמיים בארץ ומתחת לארץ. It says in the Philippians 2, therefore God is also highly exalted and given the name that is above every name. This name is special. There is no other name. There is no other name that is similar to it. Because he has power and authority. לתלמידים אמר להם ככה, ישוע אחרי שהתגלה לשליחים וניגש ישוע לדבר איתם ואמר ניתנה לי כל סמכות בשמיים ובארץ. מתיו 28, it says that ישוע came to the disciples and then he said to them, all authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. מה ניתנה לי? סמכות. What was given to him? The authority. איפה? Where? בשמיים ובארץ. In heaven and on earth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is a lot of authority in him. In, in the heavens and on earth. In the heavens and on earth. You know, you know they, were, they were afraid. Whether it was him or not, and he revealed himself to him after he rose. And so he came up to them and he said, ניתנה לי כל סמכות בשמיים ובארץ. All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. את מה שישוע שאנחנו מהללים, יש לו סמכות. This Yeshua that we worship, he has authority. בשמיים ובארץ. In heaven and on earth. אתם יודעים, נגיד למשל, אם משפחה, נגיד מישהו שיש לו סמכות בארץ, חבר כנסת, ראש ממשלה. You know, so if you think about somebody who has authority on earth, maybe a member of Knesset or יש לו סמכות, נכון? He has some authority, right? אז אנחנו בהתאם מכבדים אותו. You know, so we, we uh, honor him. לא רק אותו, גם את הילדים שלו. We honor him and his children. אנחנו לא יכולים אפילו לגשת אליהם ככה בקלות. And we can't even get to them easily. כי יש להם סמכות. Because they have authority. אבל אנחנו, But we, הילדים של ישוע, the children of Yeshua, שיש לו סמכות, who has authority, לא רק בארץ, not just on earth, גם בשמיים. But also in heaven. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. לכן אנחנו צריכים להכריז את השם הזה. So therefore we need to declare this name. אחרי זה מה הוא אמר להם? Afterwards, what did he say to them? Lechu. Go. Ta'asu. Make disciples. Amen. Amen. Atemiti, nakhon? You're with me, right? Yeshua lo stam shalach otanu be'adayim rikot. He didn't just send them with empty hands. Hu ba ve nigash, hu amar lahem, yesh li samchut. He came to them and he said, I have authority. Beshamayim ve ba'aretz. In heaven and on earth. Akshav zah tor shalachem. So now it's your turn. Lechu. Go. Ma shali marti otchem. What I have taught you. Telamdu. Teach it to others. Gam ta'asu. And to make disciples. Make disciples. In the name of Yeshua the Messiah. And always remember that the authority, my authority, therefore as believers, as servants, is that we're living in this world. There are many things that threaten us just like they threaten them. But always remember, Our authority של ישוע. It's the authority, it's אני רוצה לג... לתת לכם עדות קטנה. אני למדתי פה באוניברסיטת חיפה. I, I a, a brief testimony. I was, I was learning at uh, Haifa University. לפני 20 שנה. 20 years ago. אפילו יותר קצת. Even more than that. ובאתי ללמוד. And I came there to study. היו כמה תלמידים, כמה סטודנטיות. There were some uh, students. אחד מהם היום זאת אשתי. One of them is my wife today. והתחלתי קבוצה שם, בייבל סטדי, אנחנו... Uh, פה באוניברסיטת חיפה. חיפה ושמעו שאני עושה קבוצה, ששמעו שאנחנו עושים קבוצה, קבוצת בית כזאת, התחילו לאיים עליהם. על מה? אתם יודעים, בתור עולים, אנחנו למדנו באמת, המדינה מימנה לנו את השכר לימוד. You know, as, as immigrants, the, the government was giving funds for us to be able to learn. אפילו קיבלנו שכר כיס, דמי כיס. We even received some, some extra stipend. איך אתה יכול לעשות דבר כזה כשאתה, המדינה עושה לך ככה, ואתה פה עושה נצרות? So, so they said, how can you do this thing when the government is supporting you and then you're here promoting Christianity? באים ומאיימים. So they came and they threatened. 
אפילו בנות, אני זוכר פעם אחת, באו ואיימו עליי ככה, רוצים לתת לי בוקס. שתקתי. אני קצר, חמש שנים למדתי. But for five years I learned, המשכנו את הקבוצה, we continued the, the group, אבל אף אחד, but no one, התאספו, את יודעת, אגודת סטודנטים של יוצאי אתיופיה, הם התאספו בשבי, נגדי לעשות משהו. And you know, the, the union of, of uh, students, of, of uh, Ethiopian students, they, they got together uh, to do something against us. פנו למשרד קליטה. And they, they went to the uh, ministry of absorption. דברים. They did many things. בשביל... כאילו שלא ימומנו לי שאני אפסיק ללמוד. אבל ישוע נאמן. הוא הסמכות. המופתח בידיים שלו. במהלך כל השנים הם מאיימים, מתאספים, אומרים, אבל שום דבר לא קרה לי. למדתי, סיימתי בהצלחה. אפילו הרווחתי את שתי היקרה. הללויה. ישוע, יש לו סמכות. הסמכות הזו בשמיים ובארץ. אני רוצה לעודד אתכם כמאמינים, אנחנו, כמו שאמר, לכו, אנחנו בשם הזה נעשה את מה שהוא רוצה. אני רוצה לעזור לכם כמאמינים, כמו שאמר, לכו, אנחנו בשם הזה נעשה את מה שהוא רוצה. אני רוצה לעזור לכם כמאמינים, כמו שאמר, לכו, אנחנו בשם הזה נעשה את מה שהוא רוצה. לא רק, הוא אמר שיש לו סמכות. אחרי שהוא אמר לנו, לכו, בסוף הוא אמר משהו גם לתלמידים. הוא אמר משהו אחר לתלמידים. הנה איתכם אני כל הימים עד קץ העולם. Behold, always, איזה הבטחה. אתם מאמינים בזה? אתם מאמינים בזה? זה, זה מה שישוע אמר לנו. אני איתכם. קודם כל הוא אמר, יש לי סמכות. First שלא נפחד מאלו שמאיימים עלינו. So we won't be afraid of those who threaten us. באמת מפחיד, הרבה דברים מפחידים. You know, there really are a lot of scary things. אני בתור עולה חדש שאין לי כלום, זה מפחיד. I coming as a new immigrant, it was, it was scary. אתם יודעים, הרבה משפחות מאמינים מיוצאי אתיופיה לא באים לקהילה בגלל פחד. You know, many uh, believing families from Ethiopia, they don't actually come to the uh, congregation because of fear. מה הם מפחדים אם אתם מאמינים, המשפחות שלכם לא... בגלל זה הרבה אנשים לא באים, מפחדים. אבל כמו כיפה, כיפה התמלה ברוח הקודש, נכון? אנחנו זקוקים את הרוח הקודש בשביל באמת להאמין את מה שאלוהים אומר. ולהאמין בסמכות שלו. ולהתהלך בדרך שלו. כי באמת הוא נאמן. Because he is truly faithful. נאמן עד הסוף. He is faithful to the end. נאמן עד הסוף. He is faithful till the end. הללויה. נאמן עד הסוף. He is faithful until the end. לכן היום אני ככה רוצה לעודד אתכם ביחד, גם לי, ביחד, שנזכור את המילים האלו. So I want to encourage you and me, all of us together, that we would remember these words. זה לא משהו חדש שאני אומר לכם, אני בטוח, אתם שמעתם, יודעים. This isn't something new that I'm saying to you, I'm sure that you've heard this. אבל לפעמים אנחנו שוכחים. But sometimes we forget. There are a lot of things that happen. There was this terrorist attack and other things that happen. And so sometimes we're praying and we think it's not the time, but, but God has his time. So let's remember and come back to these words. First of all, the authority that is in the name of Yeshua. In the name of Yeshua. On earth and in heaven. בארץ ובשמיים. On earth and in heaven. בואו נאמין שיש לו מלא סמכות. Let us believe that he has so much authority. וגם, הוא איתנו. He is with us. הוא איתנו. He is with us. הוא עמנואל. He is God with us. הוא איתנו. Hallelujah. He is with us. כל מאמין, הוא צריך להאמין שאלוהים איתו. Every believer needs to believe that God is with him. אתם יכולים להגיד לי, איך אתה יודע? You can say, how do you know? Here, Elohim said, Yeshua said, Here, you are with me, I am with you all the time, to the end of the age. Here, Yeshua said it, Behold, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. I believe in Yeshua. 
I believe Yeshua. אני לא מאמין לאויב. I don't believe the enemy. אני לא מאמין מה שבן אדם אומר. I don't believe what people say. אני לא מאמין מה שאתם יודעים, הדברים בסביבי אומרים. I don't believe what the circumstances around me say. כל דבר יכול לדבר. Everything can try to speak. אבל אני רוצה לשמוע את ישוע. But I want to hear Yeshua. כמו שהוא אמר. As he said. אני רוצה לשמוע את הקול של ישוע. I want, I want to hear the voice of Yeshua. שאומר, הנה אני איתכם. that he says, behold, I am with you. Always, even until the end of the age. Therefore, this name has authority in it. And so therefore, the enemy doesn't want for us to call on this name. And so therefore, they, they said, it's forbidden for you to speak in this name. And that same spirit continues today. A lot of people say no. The, the, the religious say no. Our people say no. But we say yes. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Maybe they will bring us investigators about that. Maybe we'll have to stand before a judge or something else. Maybe we'll lose, lose our, our work. Clothes. Many things can happen. But remember, Yeshua is with us. And, and the authority is His. The authority is His. The authority is His. At the end of the day, it's very much worth it. It is very much worth it if we will listen to the voice of Yeshua. Just like that person had his life transformed. He was healed. And he became a new person. And because of him, many people came to faith. Because of what they saw. So therefore they asked, by what power? Shem? And by what name? Asitem. Did you do this? By what power? Shem? By what name? I, they, they, they didn't change. Rak b'shem Yeshua? Only in the name of Rak Yeshua. Shalo? Only by His power. Things can change. Things can change. There's nothing Afilu else. Even after 2,000 years, it's the same Yeshua. It's the same power. It's the same name. There's those who don't want to hear it. There are those who believe in Him. And we will continue. Because Yeshua is with us until the end of the age. Amen. Amen. It says in, in Proverbs 18, verse 10, מגדל עוז שם אדוני, ירוץ צדיק ונשגב. The name Hallelujah. of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous will run to it and will be safe. Hashem Aze Migdal Oz. This, this name is a strong Malay tower. Samchut. Full of authority. He has power. Shem Adonai. The name of the Lord. Bo, Beishu, Beshem Yeshua, Yarutz Tzadik Venisgav. To his name we will run and we will be safe. Yarutz Ma'amin. The believer will run. Me and you. As believers. We need to run with this name. To walk with this name. To, to, to ask this name. To sing with this name. With, with all of our heart. Because this name is a strong tower. It has power and authority. The name of Yeshua. We, we break off all the evil no deeds of the enemy. Not by our Hash, power. Hashem but by the power of that Yeshua name that is alive. Chai. Yeshua is Poel. alive. He is working and changing things. Therefore, this Malay name kuah. is a strong tower, full, full of power. Bo. We have confidence in him. We have confidence in him. You know, there, there is this life insurance, right? There's life insurance, right? Maybe somebody has life insurance. You know what? It's not, it's not really life insurance. It's insurance for death. I'll tell you why. I also have life insurance. After I die, maybe my wife will use it. 
מוות. It's, it's basically an entrance for death. אבל ישוע הוא באמת אמיתי בתוך החיים. But ישוע is truly life insurance. אמן? אמן. לכן אנחנו צריכים להאמין בשם הזה. So we need to believe in this name. לא לשמוע לאלו שאומרים לנו לא לדבר בשם הזה. And not to listen to those who say don't talk in this name. לא לשמוע לאלו שאומרים לא ללמד בשם הזה. To those who say don't teach in this name. כי המטרה שלהם because their purpose was that so that this word would not spread anymore amongst the people. But our prayer is that our people will come to Yeshua. Those two don't work together. So that's the, the, that's exactly the warfare of the enemy. That our people wouldn't hear the name of Yeshua. But we will continue to call upon his name. So therefore, I truly want to encourage you today. This is not from my heart. This is what, what God put upon my heart to speak to you. In that name, in that name, speak. In that name, in that name worship. In that name, sing. In that name, pray. In that name, do everything. Because that's what Yeshua wants. And our people will come. They will hear. And things will change. And that, that name that has been turned into a curse of Yeshua, that will, that will be wiped away. And our people, we pray, they will repent. And they will call him his true name. The name of Yeshua the Messiah. Amen. 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 Let's uh, stand together and pray. בשם ישוע אנחנו נכריז ונתפלל. In the name of Yeshua we will declare and pray. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. בואו נכריז את השם הזה, הללויה. בואו נכריז את השם, הללויה. ישוע הוא אדון, הללויה. ישוע הוא אדון, הללויה. ישוע הוא אדון, הללויה. ישוע הוא אדון. ישוע, הללויה. ישוע, הללויה. או, הללויה, ישוע. הללויה. ישוע. ישוע. ישועה הללויה. ישועה הללויה. אנחנו מכריזים בשם ישועה. We pray in the name of Yeshua Father. שתחזיר את העם שלנו. that you would bring our people back. Lord, that they would know your full name. Lord, I pray in the name of Yeshua, you would, you would rebuke that, that false name in the midst of our people. Lord, we, we bind up the thoughts of the enemy and the plans of the enemy. את השם של האויב. In the name of the enemy. אלא אנחנו מכריזים בשם ישוע משיח. But we declare in the name of Yeshua. ישוע הוא המלך. That Yeshua is king. ישוע הוא המשיח. Yeshua is our Messiah. ישוע הוא האמת. Yeshua is truth. ישוע הוא החיים. Yeshua is life. ישוע הוא התקווה של העם שלנו. Yeshua is the hope for our people. או, התקווה שלנו, הללויה. He is our hope. או, הללויה. הללויה. תקוותנו לא עבדה. Our hope has not been lost. Because the true hope, our hope is true. All Israel shall be saved. In the name of Yeshua. In the name of Yeshua. Hallelujah. In the name of Yeshua. Hallelujah. Father, I pray. Father, I pray in your name that everyone here, everyone, though that they would know your name, they would put it in their heart, 
את השם שלך. Your name. אני מתפלל בשם ישוע. I pray in the name of Yeshua. שתשים את השם שלהם, שלך, put your name בלבבות שלהם, in their hearts, במחשבות שלהם, in their thoughts, בדיבור שלהם, in their speech. כי אתה, כי השם הזה מעל כל השם. Because that name is above every other name. הזה יש עוז. In that name there's power. כוח. There's ריפוי, power, there's healing, אמת, there's truth, שחרור, there's deliverance. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Abba, Father, we thank you. Thank you for this time. Thank you that you have reminded us. It's not something new. But you want us to remember it. <laughs> That's what you said 2,000 years ago. To Peter, to John. They said, we will speak what we have heard and what we have seen. Here today, you are reminding us that your authority is in heaven and on earth. And you are with us. until the end all the days and you say to us go and speak in my name teach in my name thank you Father for your grace for your love in the name of Yeshua the Messiah Amen Amen Hallelujah Amen